Hey people, this is a quick video on those out there that keep asking how do you make a Connex 12 volt motor change speed? Now, this is what you're going to need you're going to need the 12 volt motor from Connex, you're going to want a train controller, one that says the output is 0 to 12 volt DC. That's what you're going to want. You want an AC or DC plug like this which you want to chop off that will plug into the connect motor like so make sure it's a nice fit you're going to want that you're going to want a, a terminal block a screwdriver to fit the terminal block and you want the power lead to the train controller so what you're going to do you're going to get the train controller like so you want to cut off the ends of the train controller you want to fit them into the terminal block there we go, make sure it's nice and tight so it can't pull out next you are going to want to connect the AC or DC plug now find on the train controller there should be a white line you want to connect either the white bit or a white line, whatever's on there to the white line on the train controller. Seeing that should be running the correct way and direction. Can be quite tricky. Well nice and safe so that's wired up get your plug if you want to plug that in get some power you want to plug this plug not into the motor because you'll burn it straight out connect it into the train controller right. then you want to take your plug you just wired connect it into this motor Hopefully, and you can get it to go the other way, and you're done. So that's how to wire up a train controller to a connect motor, so it's variable speed. So there you go. You can uh, do that and then you can have a variable speed, whatever you make. I make connect rides as I've got my big one which I've brought these motors for right here. It's a bit big to fit in the camera. So I've just got to fit this motor back over here. Thanks for watching. Uh, please comment, rate and subscribe. See you next time.